And when I think about what's happening across the country now, not the first time, certainly not the last time, but the exceptional politicization of trans lives for political points, and just before anybody objects, I'm not accusing anybody in this chamber of that. But if we follow along and we talk with people who are trans, we know it is the case, and it is putting their lives in significant danger. And we already know that trans people are people who suffer higher levels of violence and death because of who they are. And so to make that a political point for me is really unforgivable as a person who believes in a politics of purpose and leading with joy. It's unforgivable that we would use a person's life for politics. And again, I am not accusing anybody here, so please don't object, but it is the case. So it is important to me that we are saying out loud today that Minnesota is different. It is not just a safe harbor, but it is a place where we say by our action that you will be safe here. <laughs> You'll be safe here. You'll get the care you need here. You can be who you are here and that you are loved. You matter. I'm going to vote yes. Such a joy today. Thank you for being here. <laughs>